at their five-star wedding, Bollywood and international leading lady Tarina and her trade and industry high-flying husband Iqbal showed the world how to have a ball. And if anything, their love for each other and for entertaining has only grown stronger. We've been together for 10 years, in love for 10 years, and we thought we'd celebrate it in a, you know, kind of regal and royal way. So having a royal evening of the royal entertainment. What keeps your love so strong and continuously growing? It's just, it's a combination of so many factors. It's a combination of, of, of who I am and my thought processes, my attitude. It's a combination of his and everything that we bring together. I think we feed off each other nicely. We give each other our space to, you know, be individuals. And uh, the fact that I have butterflies every time she calls my phone, you know, means I'm still in love. <gasps> Crazy. In spite of Tarina spending months juggling her time between planning this event and producing a film, she was a picture of serenity. You look absolutely gorgeous. Your sari is amazing. It's designed by these really good friends of mine, Falgani and Shane Peacock, and I love their work. They're absolutely fantastic. Madonna wears their clothes, Nicole Scherzinger, Fergie, Lady Gaga, Britney Spears. They're just fantastic. This Mughal world by Shiran Kara was 12 weeks in the making, much of it imported from Jaipur. The deco in here is absolutely amazing. It feels like we've just stepped into little India. Yes, definitely. Our whole theme was the Mughal theme. And when we talked of that, we talked of rich colors, textures, uh, the opulence of the events, the diversity of the people that's here tonight. Which included dancer Ankita Maiti. With so few authentic Mujra dancers left in the world, this was a privilege and an education. You are a phenomenal dancer. What dance style was that? If you go to India, Indian dance style, that is Kathak, Bharatnatyam, is what I have learned from there. We also perform, I have a dance company there, so we also perform contemporary, jazz, salsa, hip-hop. Back there, people love all these things, the western styles. But back here, I see people like more of Indian, Kathak, Mujra, and very typical Bollywood songs, which is very uh, strange, but yeah, they love it. Ankita's company have danced for the president of Pakistan, the sheikhs of Dubai, and the choreography impressed newcomers to the culture and those who grew up in the tradition. The entertainment tonight has really been a taste of Bollywood. It's amazing, but then beautiful, amazing, fabulous is synonymous with Tarina Iqbal. And obviously with them taking Sharan as the person to put it all together, I think they've just made the ultimate choice. It's the best. Hasn't tonight just been so spectacular? Touch of India, red carpet rolled out, just absolutely amazing. Yeah, well, um, you know, it's, it's funny, you know, you always see these things on TV. And as a kid, when you watch this movie, you always wanted to be the main of falling in love with the ladies. And yeah, I've got all these lovely ladies dancing around me. I felt like one of those main oaks in the movie, man. Please show us a few steps. <laughs> With the influence of Indian fabric, prints and culture so strong in fashion, Tula Cindy was not going to miss this. Our viewers don't know that you and I go way back when it comes to Bollywood and tonight was literally a touch of heaven. For me it was so amazing Lorna because I got my favourite songs performed from Kuch Kuch Hota Hey. Um, Tarina Iqbal really treated us to a beautiful Indian splendorous night and just tons of fun. Which part of the evening would you say was your favourite? Oh, hands down, my favourite was the performances by the singers and the dancers they were really top performers from India and they brought that authentic and just that mega star quality and that was Terry Petal's cue what was your favorite part of this evening well I think the whole evening was such beautiful and so inspirational and so amazing to see two people who are so much in love and celebrating uh, 10 years later I mean not everyone can say that so I'm so inspired Tarina had a hit on her hands how are you gonna top the next 10 years do you really think I'm going to wait another 10 years for my next party, honey? I will keep you posted on the next one, but I'm not waiting 10 years. Tomorrow, it's back to her producer's hat and his board meetings. But be sure that the next party won't be far off.